You don't get things dried out in a very uh, short amount of time that uh, the little gremlin we called mold is going to show up. It was a soaking unlike Lincoln had seen in more than a decade, dumping more than half a foot in some areas. Now comes the next concern, mold. A lot of places get standing water, um, you know, window wells were flooding, cracks in foundations. I know it sounds crazy, it's been a couple of weeks since the storm, but it still potentially is wet. Dave Bain with A1 Complete Services says your best bet to making sure your home doesn't look like this, even if you think everything's dry, check every nook and cranny. Move your furniture away from the walls, move boxes away from the walls, and, and look. Get down on your hands and knees and feel. The health department says mold can be especially dangerous for people with allergies, asthma, and other respiratory problems. Are your gutters clean? Are the downspouts extended where water is going to run away from the foundation of the house? Are things caulked? Are they sealed? Have you looked at your sump pump lately? Questions that could save you thousands in remediation cost. Depending on the surface, sometimes mold can be cleaned by the homeowner. If you're unsure on how, the, how big the problem might be or if something is salvageable, it's always best to call a professional.